What's up guys, I'm back here with a new video and this video is going to be about how to install the exposed framework in your Redmi Note 3 Marshmallow. So without any delay, let's get started. Okay, so before starting the video, I want to tell you that you should need to keep these three things in your mind that your device must be rooted in Snapdragon variant and second one it must be running on the Marshmallow 6.0.1 it won't work with the uh, Lollipop version and third one it must have TWRP recovery installed so if these three things are done then simply go down in the description download the files uh, from the website and copy them into the phone or even in your SD card memory that doesn't matter it's gonna work fine so then you have to hold the volume up and power button from your uh, phone after turning it off and then you will get into the TWRP recovery this is the custom recovery I'm using if you want to get this go my go and watch my previous video and if it's in uh, uh, Chinese language simply go to the sixth uh, box and tap on the globe icon and select the English language and you will get into that so that is very simple all you just need to follow this video and you're done so after getting into the English mode uh, switch to the install and search for the file you have downloaded and simply look it if it's in a uh, SD card select storage and move to the micro SD card and then look at that and swipe to confirm to flash so here i have the exposed sdk 23 uh, which is for the marshmallows simply swipe to flash it will update and uh, will get installed on your phone with new exposed framework all you just need to do this nothing at all so after getting this if you feel that you want to remove it and don't want it anymore simply go back to the TWRP and simply select expose uninstaller ARM64 file I will give that link also in the description confirm swipe to flash it will again show update notification and you're done so this is how you can install and uninstall the exposed framework on your Redmi Note 3 Marshmallow running on the snapdragon variant very easily so if you still do have any questions don't forget to put that in the comment box and i will see you in the next video guys have a nice day goodbye